Glasgow's Outlander filming locations revealed on new tourist trail map. There is a grand total of five places in our city where the much-loved TV drama has been shot. A new map detailing Outlander filming locations has been published, revealing places in Glasgow where the hit TV show was shot. The guide, produced by Visit Scotland, lists a total of 36 different places throughout the country where Outlander has been filmed, including a grand total of five in Glasgow. And here they are. George Square. The iconic Central City Square was turned into a 1940s film set for Frank's memorable proposal to Claire in season one. The scene included old-fashioned cars and old-fashioned outfits, with the men trooping around the square wearing trench coats amid the real-life architecture we see in the area today. Pollock Country Park. The Southside's most loved green space made an appearance in both season one and two of the series, doubling as the setting for the fictional Castle Lock in its first appearance, and acting as the French countryside between Paris and Le Havre in its second outing. Glasgow Cathedral. Glasgow Cathedral's medieval crypt doubles as L'Hôpital de Anges, where Claire volunteers. In season two, filming took place in the stunning lower church of the cathedral. The cathedral is a popular spot for outlander tourists who usually check out the nearby necropolis too. Kelvin Grove Park The U.S. city of Boston was transported to Glasgow in season three when Kelvin Grove Park was used to replicate the Boston Park where Claire is regularly seen going for walks. The character is seen pushing her baby over a bridge in a pram with bagpipes playing in the background. Glasgow University The university, the fourth oldest university in the English-speaking world, doubles as the famous U.S. institution Harvard, where Frank teaches as a professor. Filming took place here during the summer and winter of 2016 for season 3. For more information on the Outlander map and tourist route around the country, you can head to visit Scotland's dedicated webpage here.